Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the Horror Fiend tag. My good friend John over at Horror Fiend Reviews created the Horror Fiend tag just so that we could all get to know each other better. And basically it's six questions, they're all horror related, and I'm going to answer all of the questions today. Question number one is, what is your first memory of watching a horror movie? Growing up, my parents weren't really into horror movies or anything like that, so I didn't actually start watching horror movies until I was a bit older. But the very first memory I have of watching a horror movie was when I was pretty young. I don't remember how old I would have been, maybe around seven or eight years old, but I do remember being at my aunt's house and watching a scary movie there. And I don't even remember what the movie was called or what it was really even about. I just remember that it was a paranormal movie. And I just remember being so scared after I watched that movie. Like, I could not sleep for days. So that's my very first memory of watching a horror movie. I remember always being interested in horror movies and I loved watching them, but then after I would be really scared for a while, so. That was fun. Question number two is name your favorite horror movie kill. I have a couple that I wanted to mention. So the first one is from the movie Jason X where he freezes a girl's head in liquid nitrogen and then he smashes her head against the table. I just think that's a really unique kill and it's just absolutely hilarious. Like it's so ridiculous. How did they think of that? That is just so funny. And the second one is the curling iron kill in Sleepaway Camp. And if you've seen this movie, you know what I'm talking about. That would just be the worst way to die. It would just be absolutely horrible. Question number three is recite your favorite horror movie quote. I really had to think about this one, but I think my favorite quote would have to be from The Reanimator, where Herbert West says, cat dead, details later. And just for a little bit of context, this is where Dan finds his cat dead in the refrigerator, and he's like, you couldn't call or write a note? And then Herbert West replies, I was busy pushing bodies around, as you would know. And what would a note say, Dan? Cat dead? Details later? I just think it's so hilarious. So that would have to be my favorite horror movie quote. Question number four is, what's a horror movie that you love but everyone seems to hate? And I actually decided to talk about a show for this one, and that would be the show from Dusk Till Dawn, which is based off of the movie. And I'm not sure if anyone actually hates this show, but I don't hear anyone ever talking about it, and I think it is so amazing. The From Dusk Till Dawn TV series was created and directed by Robert Rodriguez, who also directed the original movie. I guess he said that there was a lot more that he wanted to explore with the movie that he didn't get a chance to, so that's why he went ahead and created this TV series. I feel like it would be really hard to cast a show when the movie is so popular, but I feel like they did a really good job of casting the show. I really like the actors that they chose, and like for example, Danny Trejo is in the movie and Wilder Valderrama is in this movie as well, and I think they are amazing in their roles. And I just got so addicted to the show, like I seriously binge watched it in like a very short period of time. So if you haven't seen it, I would recommend that you give it a chance because it is really good. Question number five is, would you rather watch your all-time favorite horror movie every day for the rest of your life or meet your horror idol dead or alive for 15 minutes? So first of all, I feel like if I watched my favorite horror movie every single day of my life, I would get really bored of it and it would no longer be my favorite horror movie. So I'm not gonna go with that option. But at the same time, I don't really have like one specific horror idol that I would love to meet. I'm not really the type of person that goes to cons and like has to go meet people and get their autograph and things like that. That being said, I think it would be really cool to meet Stephen King. I just think it would be really cool to talk to him about his books and like what his inspiration is and how he gets his ideas for the things he writes. And I'm not sure if you could consider him like a horror idol, but I would love to meet Doyle from The Misfits. It's a horror punk band, so that could maybe be a horror idol, I don't know. Number six is, tell me a horror movie you think I should check out. So John, I think you should check out Demonic Toys. I'm not sure if you've seen this movie, I can't remember if we've talked about it, but basically people get trapped in a haunted toy warehouse. And I wouldn't say that this is like the best movie in the whole world, but it's just so cheesy that it's good. So if you're looking for a cheesy and fun horror movie, I think you should definitely check that one out. So those are all of the questions for the Horror Fiend tag. Make sure to check out John's YouTube channel. He posts a lot of great content and I will 
I'll put a link to his channel down below, so make sure to check that out. And I decided not to tag anyone this time, but if you want to do this video, you should definitely do it. And if you make a video, let me know in the comments below and I will make sure to check it out. And if you guys have any recommendations for horror movies that you think I should watch, let me know in the comments below. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one.